This video today is brought to you by Flow Bottle. Flow Bottle, the bottle with a twist. Get your Flow Bottle today at flowbottle.com. Link in description below. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. So this video is a rules of wrestling video, and this is just scoring and then how a match works. So in wrestling, we've got three periods, all right? High school and college is a little different. I'm gonna go with those rules though, okay? So in high school, you've got three two-minute periods. In college, you have a three-minute period and then two two-minute periods, all right? At the end of each period, the the match will stop. The ref will either flip a coin. So at the second end of the second period, or into the first period, the ref will flip a coin. It'll be either green or red, and it'll do the same thing the third period. What that's going to do is whoever is wearing the green ankle band or the red ankle band, depending on which one it flips, is going to have their choice of top, bottom, neutral, or defer. All right, we'll go into all those. Okay, so neutral. There will be in wrestling. You're going to have a little square rectangle. All right, both guys are gonna have to put their foot on the line. They'll have to shake hands, all right? And then once the ref blows the whistle, they start wrestling. This is called neutral, okay? Same square box. So if you wanna go down for me, Trent. Okay? So your hands and your knees are gonna be, your knees are gonna be behind the square box and your knees are gonna be in front of it, all right? This is called bottom, okay? The other wrestler is gonna start on top. His hand has to cup the elbow, his other hand has to go across his belly, all right? His back knee has to go up, all right? And his other knee has to go to the side, all right? And then his ear has to go on his back, all right? The ear, so if I'm on the left side, my left ear. If I'm on the right side, my right ear has to go down. This is called top, okay? Defer is just deferring to him, so he gets the choice. So if it lands on, if I'm green, and it lands on green, and I wanna defer, all that means is, when it comes to the third period, if I make it that far, or if the match goes that long, I will get the choice, okay? So top, bottom, neutral, defer, all right? Now, the way a match is scored, or won, or I'm sorry, let me go into this. The way a match is won, okay? You can either win by points, Okay, so that's between one and seven points. So anywhere in there, you're winning by points. All right, you can win by major decision, which is anywhere from eight to 14 points in folk style. All right, you can win by a technical fall, which is 15 points or more if the individual is not on their back. So if I'm up 14 to nothing, but I take Trent down and put him on his back, the ref is gonna give me an opportunity to pin the opponent. Okay, and that's the other way to win, is by pin, all right? So a pin is, so Trent, why don't you lay down right here? Okay, a pin is when he goes and both of his shoulder blades touch. So we wear singlets that expose the shoulder blades. The second those shoulder blades touch, it's a pin, match is over if the ref calls it, all right? Now you gotta remember, a lot of this has to do with the ref's discretion, okay? The other way to win is by disqual disqualification or injury. All right, which means the guy did something to break the rules and the ref disqualified him, or you're injured and you can no longer compete in the match. All right, and that's where either the ref, your coach, or yourself take you out of the match and you are no longer competing. Okay, the way a match is scored. All right, so if, if I go to take Trent down, all right, and he hits his hips and I have both legs, if I'm here, even if I'm here, way down on his ankles, this is two points, okay? Unless Trent is fighting it. So like, let's say Trent has my body locked. So lock the body. This is not two yet until I get my head out, okay? If I have a single leg, okay? So get it on a single. All right, and I'm here, and I catch this ankle and get him on his hip. This is two points, okay? In college, a takedown is worth three now. All right, so if you're wrestling collegiate, it's worth three. If you're wrestling high school or lower, it's worth two, okay? Give you another example, all right? So if I hit a drag, all right, and I'm here behind Trent, but I haven't taken him down yet, and his hand touches, that's two points, okay? He doesn't need to go to the mat, all right? If he does go to the mat and I'm on top, it's also two points, okay? So 
Another way, you can get two. So let's say, so his hips on the ground, you've got control. All right, a lot of this, there's some intricacies there. And if you guys want to see more on that or kind of want me to go into the specifics of a takedown, um, let me know in the comment section. Just comment below, hey, you know, ask the question, you know, is this two or whatever? Send a picture or a video. Um, you could DM me and I'll answer that question for you. But another way too is if I'm on top here and I go behind. All right, that is two points. Okay? Now, when it comes to being on bottom, there's a few ways you can score. You can get an escape or you can get a reversal. All right? So let's say Trent's down. He stands up, breaks away, and there's space. All right? It can't be touching him. He's got to get away and, or in face. Okay? So if I'm here, all right, but he turns into me, that's two as well. Or that's one as well. I'm sorry. So he's turned and faced me. Okay? But if Trent is trying to get away, trying to get away, and I push him out of bounds, but he never faced me, it's not one point. Okay? And then another one is a reversal. All right, so if Trent is down, so I'll just hit a switch. Okay. Trent's down, all right, and he gets behind me, that's a reversal, that's two. All right, used to be college was a takedown was two, reversal was two, now a takedown's worth three, reversal's only worth two. All right, so just keep that in mind. Is there anything else? Near fall. Oh yeah, near fall. So last thing. Okay, the other way we can score. Oh, go in your belly. All right, so when we put somebody on their back, so what constitutes being on their back? This is 90, once they go past this, the ref will start counting, okay? So if I'm here in a half Nelson, I'm here, nothing. One, two, all right? In high school, the ref is gonna count to two, that's two points. Then he's gonna count to five, that's three points, okay? So there's three extra seconds, get you one extra point. In college, the ref's gonna count to two, two points. He's gonna count to four, and that's four points. All right? So there's a big difference there. When that move was changed, or when that uh, rule was changed, there was a huge discrepancy in scores. All right? So just be aware of that, okay? That's it. That's how you score in wrestling. Can you think of anything else? I think that's All right. it. All right. Um, if I left anything out, please contact me via Instagram at Barbell Robertson or just leave it in the comment section below and I will look that over and I'll try to uh, make an amend amendment to this video. And um, yeah, I'm also going to be doing a penalties, rules of wrestling video as well. And then I will also go into Greco and freestyle once that season starts. So I hope you guys like this video. I appreciate you guys tuning in. Make sure you tell your friends. If you're a parent, tell your friends. If they don't know how to score a wrestling match or they don't know what they're looking at, Make sure you go and share this. Oh, one more, more thing I want to look at. The guy goes out of bounds. So let's go right here. Get on your butt. Oh my butt. Yep, if he goes out of bounds, let's say he's going out of bounds, all right, and I catch his ankles and then we go out, that's still two, okay? The ref will give a little bit of leeway out of bounds, all right, and the rules give a little bit of leeway out of bounds for you to score a takedown as well. So if I go and I catch the ankle, even though I'm out going out of bounds technically, or he is out of bounds, it's still gonna be two, okay? So if you guys like it, make sure you like the video, make sure you comment what you wanna see next, and don't forget to subscribe.